All right, Rocket. We're back on track. Huh? Oh, yeah. Uh, good for you. It ain't stealing if it's abandoned. We. Oh, flog. Rocket. Not now, Quill. Rocket. Perhaps he has located our monster. We don't even know what it looks like. The intel was extremely vague. It wasn't vague, it was rushed. It's probably some cute little... Nightmarish... Whoa! Careful! Oh, well, you got some timing. We got company. Is this from the last dumper? We haven't even placed it yet. This place is... Say, it's far and scary out there, Quill. Flarknard's on the field. Danger on all sides. Then it's time we stand and face it and make sure they're nullified. Are we heroes to be laughed at? No! I'll laugh at them instead. Who's with me? Wise words, Peter Quill! We are! Time the bl- How do you know? My senses are fine-tuned to measure even the tiniest vibrations. Really? No, I'm tracking it on my display. The Milano should be right on the other side of this door. It was open when I came through here. Who says I tripped on something? Murder Mom probably closed the door behind her. Excuse me? spot for the last thump. I'll know it when I see it. I am Groot. Fine. Me and Groot were messing with some substance. I may have tripped something. I am Groot. I said I may have. Look. It looks like it's still got some juice. Give it a go, Rocket. Watch a genius at work. You are a miracle worker, man. This tech was built by people who make holes in giant floating space rocks. I have to say, that is an immaculate... <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is it. Last spot. Can't wait to be out of here. This place feels like it's about to collapse on itself. I cannot wait to meet our monster. I thought you were mostly interested in meeting the buyer. She is a respectable collector. Is it working? Yeah, yeah, don't worry, Sunshine. <laughs> Ow! Is it, uh, doing it? What? 
It appears to be broken. Ain't nothing broke. That's the sound it's supposed to make. What sound? You can't hear that. Hear what? Oh. Our monster. Hey, that thing's fast! Don't let it get behind you! It could be poisonous! That's one less thing to hide behind. Good thinking, Quill. Come on, slice him up! Knife to me! Kala! thing stinks! It must possess a defensive center plan. Slow it down. Round him up, crew! <laughs> what the flark is that? Definitely not a monster. Adorable. It's more matted than an Asgardian goat. We cannot present this pathetic creature to the monster queen of Sektoff 9. She will laugh at us. Maybe we can use it as bait. I knew those thumpers wouldn't work. What? My thumpers are state-of-the-art. Musclehead's the one who rushed at the first thing that came through the door. My head is not made of muscle. That is a monster. All right. Enough with the warm up. Time to catch us a real monster. Let's get paid. What in hell's name is that? Definitely not cleaner bots. This is crapping out. We gotta get out of here! Now! Curse these volatile ruins! Tracks, go! Hold on to your butts, people! Rocket, get the music! On it! Focus on flying, Peter! Someone play this man a song! Now we're talking! Watch the ship! I'm watching, I'm watching! You ain't! Drax, what are you doing? I am holding my buttocks as Peter Quill instructed. Someone give me a hand. Am I right? How about one upside the head? Heads up! We have debris incoming! Blow it away, Quill! Thread the needle! Don't even think about it! The quickest way through is through! Peter! You fear dying with a guilty conscience, assassin! Don't you get go on my ship! My ship! Oh, that's it! Let me drive! You're gonna get us killed! We're not dead yet! Maybe we are, and this is hell! Do not be ridiculous! This place lacks the eternal frost of Sardu! Your hell is frozen? The Tathians do not like to be cold! Try putting on a shirt! See? Peace, so. Root says watch out! Yeah, thanks for the heads up! You want me to take the control? No, I've got this! Clearly! Watch it! Don't get us killed, Quill. There's still so much stuff I want to steal. We ain't 
gonna make it. Hit the blue button! One blue button! The one for the secret posters I added! Can you please stop adding things while I'm asleep? Punch it, Peter! Now is not the time for hand-to-hand -hand combat. Whoa! Look, yeah! Definitely a fan of the blue button! We're shot on all sides. We ain't gonna make it! I'll make it! Maybe! There's the exit! See? Home stretch! Our last breath! Yeah! And that's what I call a win, people! How's that a win? Our monster just got eaten! Whatever you can fly away from... Means you screwed up because you had to fly away from it. Please don't be Novacore, please don't be Novacore, please don't be Novacore. It is Novacore. Hope. Uh, did you say Hal is Hope? Um, <clears throat> there's a uh, this uh, thing I got. I gotta do. I'll, I'll be right back. We need to get rid of that animal now. <sighs> I'm serious, Peter. If it stays on the ship, we all go to prison. No one's going to jail. It's a harmless space llama thingy. Harmless? Remember Anakubi? Uh, not really. No. That's because they scorched the planet because an idiot smuggled in an Exelon. I will eject the beast into space. Whoa, 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 we're not ejecting anything. It'll make us look guilty. <laughs> it could be carrying Zephron's disease. Which is why Drax is gonna hide in the secret cargo compartment behind Groot's plants. Peter. Jason. Quill. Really? My middle name? Hey, Corell! How you doing? How long's it been? Two, three years? You look good. You been tanning? This is a new low, Peter. Even for you. Corral, I swear it's not what it looks like. That you're a junker trespassing in the most restricted area of space? Who consorts with thieves and murderers, apparently. Hey, killing people for money ain't murder, lady. Nice to see you too, Corral. Come on, Corral. You know me. We've been to hell and back. Sure, I've done some shady stuff since the war. Like, really shady stuff. But junking? I just caught you pink-handed, leaving the quarantine zone. Technically, yes, but we weren't scavenging. Right. Peter Quill, I found these items in the uh, space that you told me about. There was not enough room for both the other thing and these. Peter Quill, of planet C-53, under galactic law ZXP-47, I am putting you and your crew under arrest for Actually, can I call you back? What? Please. Tell me that is not a crate of super illegal tech. It is a crate of super illegal tech, which also happens to be very valuable. Really? What? We're on a Ravager ship. Even the Flark and Bulkheads are stolen. Well, we can't fit both in the compartment. I will eject the crate into space. Eject the crate, and I melt your face! The Milano's weapon systems are four generations behind, Quill. We need that tech, more than we need some stupid farm animal. That farm animal could be a class 3 biohazard. You want to end up in the kiln? Hide rockets crate. Peter, you're willing to gamble on a space llama thingy? I'll convince Corell the llama's harmless. She knows me. And I know Corell. Not like I did. You slept with a cop? She wasn't a cop back then. The point is, I can get us out of this, guys. You just gotta trust me. I am Oh, and that would be your boarding party. You just speak to Centurion Corral. Silence, prisoner. The commander has no time to meet with law-breaking pirates like you. That's just it. We're not pirates. We're legally incorporated heroes for hire. 
Yeah, that's right. You check those records, Buckethead. Novacore licensing permit 67398-2. Gardeners of the Galaxy? What? No. Rocket. So, I let Groot fill out the paperwork. I fixed it with an addendum. Not the most well-known heroes you could hire, but definitely in the top five of most awesome names. Contributing members. Groot, a Flora Colossus. Last of his kind, fearless in a firefight, an awesome best friend. Rocket, bona fide super genius and a wizard with explosives. Definitely not a raccoon. Gamora, adopted daughter of Thanos, deadliest woman in the galaxy. Need we say more? Drax the Destroyer, convicted serial murderer and galactic war hero? Often grumpy. Last and definitely least, Peter Jason Quill. That's it? That's all you wrote? It was a character limitation. <sighs> Sorry, excuse me, I just need to... Cadet Gold, what are you doing here? Oh, you don't know? Really? It says right here, prisoner processing training. I'm your official trainee. Aren't you a little young for the Corps? Aren't you a little old for that hairdo? I should check with the captain. No. No, 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 no. She, she definitely signed off on this. You know how thorough she is about signing stuff? And if I may, sir, the real concern here is Regulation 7A regarding prisoner footgear. That one's jet boots are in clear violation. They're decorative. Good work, Cadet Gold. Great. There goes Plan B. No, you do not got this, pirate. I got this. Now fall in line. Not to go, prisoners. Watch the jacket. Get that gold. You know the arrest protocols? All memorized, sir. First thing we do... First thing you do is apologize. We're legitimate business-like folk on legitimate-like business. There's so much wrong with this arrest. A, no way a kid should be... I'm an official trainee. And B, I'm very, very close friends. Uh-huh. Hold it right here. Is there a problem? Yes! No faith, energy, no power. No power. No containment. A single spot. The techs are looking at it. They say that... They cannot even fathom. How can they fix what they cannot understand? Put the Grand Unifier's mind at ease. Run the scanners again. What the flark is a Grand Unifier? Grand Unifier Raker. Leader of the Church of Universal something. He was floating dead in the quarantine zone. Looking for God. All right, pirates. Let's go. We caught him just like we caught you. The difference is, I know the captain. As I was saying, if you just tell the captain that I Mom explicitly said she doesn't want to see you. Yeah, Quill. Bro never no! mentioned you must have that. <laughs>
girl! <coughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. Let me just see if I can... Hold on! I wish I... Get my chance! Get boots! Did that go, was it? Nikki? Oh, it's nice to meet you, Nikki. <laughs> okay, Nikki, here's the plan. You're gonna jump and grab my legs while I hold on for dear life. That doesn't sound like... Trust me, kiddo. We got this. around the corner we'll be safe there here help me with this ready together on three two one <laughs> go go yeah. okay we need to keep moving this way yeah nikki whoa Just stay i close. knew there was something wrong about that church who goes fishing for god in a junkyard Blast doors kick in during emergencies. Pretty sure I can override them with my passkey. They give out override keys to trainees? Not exactly. Just give me a sec. Come on. You no, know, I could probably help with the door if we undid these cuffs. Regulation 3B. Never undo restraints. Come on. You clearly need my help. No! You're my prisoner. And I got this. <sighs> Obviously. Ah! Okay, we're gonna have to find another way. We sure there isn't a way through here? I'm in charge. Whoa! Ah! <laughs> you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. You? Oh, dandy. Okay, this way. Shouldn't we be going up? Back toward the others? There's another blast. Whoa! Are you kidding me? Relax, you're fine. I mentioned how useful my jet boots will be right now. Okay. I can do this. I'm not or anything. Almost there. Can you please stop squirming? I'm trying to focus. Okay, okay. Yes! Got it! Through here! Whew! <laughs> Nice work. Thanks. You didn't do too bad yourself, pirate. Only Star Lord. Or Peter, or, you know, Nova Cadet Butt Saber. Okay. Peter. So, listen. I have some good news and some bad news about your friends. 
Uh, start with the bad, I guess. Your friends have been processed and put in the brig. So what's the good news? They're not dead. Come on. We'll be safe through here. Flark! Pipes must have burst. Should we try using that thingamajig of yours to call someone? We don't need help. I know what I'm doing. Now help me block this fire so we can get through. Sure. Just that everyone must be worried. Captain's kid goes missing. Easy does it. There, see? You don't need to worry about me. Enough people around here do that already. For what it's worth, I think you're doing great. As good an arresting officer as I've ever had. Are you seriously trying to sneak away on me right now? You literally just said I was doing great. You are doing great. Top five best arresting officers I've ever had. Cool. So can you please just show me the same respect you would any other arresting officer? <laughs> That's exactly what I'm doing. Unbelievable. Yeah, I get that a lot. Is that robot wearing makeup? What? Oh, yeah. That's just it's. I um I know all the bots down here. They're kind of my friends, I guess. I reprogrammed most of them. You gave them faces. Maybe. No, I mean it's cool. Give them personality. Very cool. Come on, this way. Does your mom know you play down here? Probably not. But what else am I gonna do? Not like there's any other kids on board. You know, I didn't have a lot of friends at your age either. Granted, I was in prison, but still. So mom was right about you. It was a Shatari prison. I was just a kid. I have so many questions. Were your parents in prison too? No, my mom, uh, died. I didn't know my dad. How do you know my mom, exactly? Uh, we fought together on Mercury during the war. She was, a, is, a real spitfire. More like real controlling. And bossy, and judgmental. You're just a kid, Nikki. You don't know what's good for you, Nikki. Stay out of the escape pods, Nikki. Pretty sure all kids get annoyed with their moms, but as you get older, you realize they're right more often than not. Ugh, whatever. Where do you think you're going? Just making sure this place is safe and secure from the, you know, fire. This way. Are you sure this is the quickest way to the brig? I thought you didn't want to go to the brig. Okay. If this is an attempt to escape your mom's ship, I really need to know, because I may or may not be super interested. Just really need to make sure it doesn't look like a kidnapping. What? No, no. Oh, wow. Don't laugh. Is this your mom single-handedly winning the war? Obviously, I know she didn't do it by herself. No. That final push was, uh, it was a massive team effort. Were you there? Uh, I contributed to the war effort differently. Pirating? Raiding, which is, you know, the good kind of pirating. Hey, this is Mercury, right? Uh-huh. It's supposed to represent this big battle Mom was part of. You said you were there, right? Oh, yeah. Your mom was dead in the water until me and the Ravager sh Hey! Secret stuff. Off limits. No adults. I get it. Anyway, I'm all done here. We should probably get back before Mom completely freaks. Yeah, I've seen your mom overreact before. It's like... I'm not a kid anymore, you know? Tell me about it. So, you get where I'm coming from, right? Like if you do end up talking to my mom? Say no more. I'll make sure Corel knows what a good job you did. No! I mean, thanks. But ideally, mom never needs to know I was in the Hank. So I never saw you?
Almost at the elevator. We're home free. Need a hand? Yes! Got it! Mom? I can explain. <sighs> Nikki. I'm fine. Mom, seriously. A-OK. -okay. Barely a scratch. What in Hall's name were you thinking? Sneaking out with an arresting squad. Running around with criminals. Alleged criminals. You almost died. Do you have any idea how rounded you are right now? Mom! You promised to give me more leeway. Leeway doesn't mean lying to my officers. Or sneaking around behind my back. Look, it's my fault some guy's ship blew up. Restricted areas are restricted for a reason. You treat me like a prisoner. You're a child. Are you even listening? Whoa, whoa. We've all been through a lot today. Let's just all take a deep breath and recognize that maybe we've all made some mistakes. Make sure the fire is out and the hangar secure. Yes, Commander. And find out why that churchman's shuttle exploded. Grand Unifier Raker has been less than cooperative. Make him cooperate. And you two? With me. I knew you'd overreact. You always overreact. Even Peter was saying so. Oh, he was, was he? I suspect Peter misspoke, something he often tends to do. For what it's worth, Nikki totally saved my butt. She handled herself really well, and you have every reason to be proud of her. Coming from you, Peter, it's worth extraordinarily little. Why are you being mean to him? Just listen to what he's saying. I don't care what he's saying. Upper level. Captain's quarters. Fine. Initiate lockdown. Lockdown initiated. What, are you gonna kill us? In theory, these doors don't open until I say so. Yeah, I know how lockdown works. I don't think you do, because somehow you keep bypassing every security measure on this ship, and I want to know how. Or you can just show me. Mom! <laughs> Initiate not lockdown. All good for systems go. Activate. Voice print not authorized. Just trying to help. We don't need your help. You're the last person we need help from. Well, you clearly need some form of help if you're trapping us in an elevator. No one leaves until you tell me what I want to know. You already know everything! No, I don't. I know you're a magnet for danger. And that you somehow keep getting caught in restricted areas of this ship. I'm small. Okay? I fit into places. Being small doesn't get you past security or through the hangar bay checkpoint, or the maintenance tunnel blast doors, or even into the sub-level I just found you in. So... There was that system-wide glitch, remember? Yeah. Yeah, security was down for a while. No, it wasn't. Seemed pretty down to me. Are you seriously lying for a 12-year-old right now? 12? Oh wow, I thought she was at least 16. Peter! What? Like, she really knew her stuff. She's a smart kid too smart. She keeps bypassing security. Unless you have a level 6 access to my ship all of a sudden? Didn't think so. Nicolette Gold, empty your pockets. No. You empty your pockets. Nikki? What? She has a passkey thingy. You have a what? I saved your life. I saved your life. Hand it over. I can't believe you read it. She is your mom and the captain of the ship, which gives her absolute authority here. Including the ability to release certain people who may have been unjustly... Unbelievable. Disengage lockdown. Lockdown disengage. So, can I go help secure the hangar now? No, you can go back to your quarters and you can stay there for the next 30 rotations. But mom! I can make it 30 cycles. So, rough day, huh? Exploding shuttles, quarantine zone trespassers, missing kid. I have no idea. Chewie. I can't believe you still have him. I can't believe you survived. Mercury was what, like a thousand degrees? More like a thousand cycles ago. 
You can keep him if you want. He is yours. Hey, I ordered him to look out for you. Expect him to keep doing his job. Especially, you now have a daughter, apparently. Twelve-year-old daughter, who you didn't have during the war. Twelve years ago, when we... Peter. When we picked up your ship, part of me was excited. At first. But then after all this time, you haven't changed. At all. You're still the same... I've changed! Whatever the fine is, I'll pay. Just give me th three cycles. Let me prove that I'm not still... whatever it is you're gonna finish that sentence with. You're gonna pay 8,000 units in three cycles? Wow, okay, that is... a lot of money. I was thinking that maybe... The fine's non-negotiable. My search party found a Class II biohazard wandering around your ship. That's yeah, all they found, right? Okay, okay. You'll get your money on time, no problem. This Guardians of the Galaxy thing, we are this close to getting it off the ground. And if I didn't have these handcuffs on, I would show you just how very close we are. Why do I feel like I'll regret this? Oh, come on. When have I ever... You won't regret it! I promise. You've got three cycles, Peter. Not four, not five, three. Contact me when you've got the units. And if we don't? The device we installed will deactivate your ship, and you will all go to prison. Gotcha. We won't let you down. You could get us out of this. I did. 8,000 units is a small price. 8,000 to... units? That is a tremendous sum. Where are we going to get that kind of money in three cycles? By robbing a freaking bank, apparently. Okay. So we got fined. So we have a Nova tracking thing on our ship that's going to shut down our engines if we don't pay that fine in three cycles. At least we're not on a prisoner transport. Not yet. Oh, come on, guys. You're Drax the Destroyer, man. You killed Thanos. Allegedly. Are you gonna let a little fine slow you down? And Gamora, you're practically an MI6 agent, but way hotter and, and cooler. There's nothing you can't do. Here it comes. Rocky, you're an actual genius and the scrappiest dude I know. How many prisons did you break out of? Seven. Seven. I am Groot. You are Groot. Guys, we're supposed to be a team. All we need to do is figure out how broke we are and come up with a plan. So check your quarters. Check between the sofa cushions. Check under the crafting bench. If you find any spare units lying around, grab them. I'll do the same in my quarters. All right. This is why you don't sleep with cops, Quill. They put bombs on my ship. My ship. <sighs> I am watching you, rodent. What's that supposed to mean?